Guten Tag one and all, welcome back to the channel. Sorry that this is an episode 6 of How Not to Travel America, but that will be with you on the weekend, so do be patient. As we speak, I may or may not be alive, in a way. Uh, I'm on a mission. Uh, for those of you who didn't know, I'm on a straight line mission, uh, which is partly why the episode release dates have been sporadic. But for now, I'm really looking forward to playing this again, Chrono Photo. Last week, or a couple of weeks ago, we, we had a go at this for the first time, thoroughly enjoyed it. But I didn't really know how hard it would be or what parameters to set myself. So on this go, 4,000 points. That's what we're going for. It's as simple as that. Party? Let's just play for now. I don't know how many goes this will take me in this video. Two feels like a good amount, but maybe we can squeeze three in. So, first one. Oh my god. Ha! Is that Donald? I think it is, isn't it? It's just not pulling his usual... It is pulling a strange face. Uh, what have we got on the table? <laughs> oh my god. I thought it was like, you know, fancy cakes and stuff, but I think it it's fast food. Um, he's in the White House, right? I think this is the White House. I don't know. I, I did visit the place not so long ago, but we got Abraham Lincoln, I believe, on the wall without a hat. So I think this is the White House. I haven't got a clue what's going on with, with all this. I can't read it is the problem. OFI. Oh, fi oh, fillet of fish. So it is McDonald's. He's having a McDonald's party. <laughs> you gotta laugh, haven't you? So he was in office in 2016. Um, could it be some sort of anniversary of McDonald's? How they kept them warm, by the way, I'll have no idea. Uh, when was McDonald's created? Don't think it really matters. I am... I think I'm going to have to judge it on sort of how old he looks and... I think I'll go 2018. Oh, it was 2019! It was 2019. I was tempted to go for that at one point, but I'm, I'm pleased to be one year out. Very pleased. Five of those will take us to well over what we need, around 4,600. So let's move on. Goodness. I don't know how much detective work I'm going to be able to do on some of these. Many of you rightly pointed out in the last episode that I should have done better in that regard uh, with that African or Asian computer room. Uh, because it had Windows 10. So that's the kind of thing I need to look out for. No computers in this one, but we do have a couple of vehicles. The van looks oldish, or it would in a western city. The motorbike, I can't really date. I think what we can use a bit more here is the coats and the hairstyles. What country is this, is, is a good question. We've got the word coffee there. Could it be Taiwan? Bit of English, maybe. I don't know. Could it be Hong Kong? Is there a significance to each photo in that? Could this be the day that Hong Kong became independent from Britain, 1997? I was thinking that it looks 90s. And I would say late 90s. I'm going to go 1997. Uh, but this could be wildly out. It's hard. It's hard, to be honest, to... Me and my mates used to play a game sometimes and we had nothing better to do, where we used to watch old reruns of, like, Wheel of Fortune, Bruce's Price is Right, things like that, on, on Challenge. And we'd try and guess the year and it would come up at the end in Roman numerals. And it's it's hard, even in Britain, to guess the 90s year. It's usually later than you think, but in another country, that's even harder. I'm going to stick with 97. 91. 
Yeah, okay, so in Asia, maybe it's the other way. Maybe it's always earlier than you think. Right, that has dented my score, but we're still good. We're still good for now. Oh my goodness, look at this. This is so old. Look at the top hats. This looks like Belgium or Netherlands, without a doubt. Um, it's going to be about the fashion though, isn't it? It's going to be, when were these hats in fashion? Top hats. I mean, it'd be stupid to go later than 1910, wouldn't it? I think 1905, I'll go. 1900, it was as early as you can get. And the 4,000 points is now looking pretty unlikely. I think we need to be one year out twice. Oh my goodness. This is an old photo as well. Kids playing with a football in Japan. 1904, oh, 1920, this has gone rapidly, rapidly south. We're on a score of 2-2-2-2, two, 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 two. it's a shocker. And this, that's a Christmas tree in the trenches. They're German hats, are they not? So that, I think 1914, the first winter of the Great War where people were still in fairly good spirits. Are they burning it? I hope not. There we go. We've ended on a high and we've ended on 3-2-2-2. So not a disrespectable score in the end. That's given me hope. Right. Bearded Burger. Bearded Burger. Where's this? My first instinct was the UK, but I don't know. Can't see the license plate. That's just cut off. Facebook, Twitter, I presume Instagram. I presume we've got other things there. Sides. Ah, now that number, 317. Yeah, I think that's American. Um, the people sort of look American too. Especially her. That's just basically Lois Griffin. Having had one too many burgers. Um, date, 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 date. Well, these kind of like bougie burger things I feel have really kicked off in the last five years. But that's in Britain. I can't speak for America. Burgers are American. So, if there's any sort of... Oh, yeah, they do have dirty... I was going to say, dirty fries. I mean, if you'd have had that on a menu 15 years ago, people would have gone, dirty fries? What the bloody hell is that? No, thank you. I'll stick to normal fries. But now, all these kind of, like, fun nicknames have crept in, which is great. Um, so, I'm going to date this... His hoodie... I don't know about this guy's clobber. I'm going to go, tw like, I, I think because of the dirty fries, I'm going to keep it fairly recent. 2017. 2022. Fuck. Cheers, mate. With your 2017 clobber. Oh, that's, um, that's just annoying. 640 points. Let that be the dent. <laughs> oh my god, Michelin tyres, look at those, they're terrifying. They are terrifying, mate. So the Michelin man has been around for yonks. Houston, Texas, Michelin tyres. Tyres. You would think wouldn't have really been that needed or that widespread before 1905, but looking at this, it's all horse and carts. 
So this has got to be around then. In downtown Houston, Texas, what would have the what would the ratio have been of cars to horse and carts in say nineteen oh five? Probably still mainly horse and carts, especially down there, especially down in the deep south. In New York, LA may be different, mainly New York. So for that reason I'm gonna go like nineteen oh seven. I was just I wish I'd just stick to my gut. 1905 would have been much better. Would have got me 250 more points. Damn. I'm definitely frustrating some of you with my last minute alterations. Um, we can still do it this time though, but we need we need some strong ones. Where is this? This is New York, isn't it? I think so. And on this one, guys, I'm just gonna try and go off fashion. Ah, we got a lot of masks. We got a lot of masks. Fashion, I'm thinking, is very up to date, very current. This jacket's pretty cool. This girl's baggy, baggy stuff is in, isn't it? And here we've got baggy as well. Um, we've got a couple of masks but not that many, so it can't really be 21 or 20. Some of the mask wearers are Asian, who are more likely to wear masks anyway, even before COVID. So I'm, I'm just gonna go 2022. Come on, that's good. That's really boosted my chances now. So really we can be sort of three years out twice, which is still a big ask. Ah, oh, right, number four, come on. Where are we here? Where are we and when are we? Belt line to all ferries, Southern Ferry and Central Park, South Ferry and Central Park. So this is New York. So my earlier question might be answered here. Cars versus Horse and carts. Got a lot of trams. Battery, yes, is, I think this is definitely New York. I don't see really many cars at all. I don't see a road that's built for cars. I see a lot of horses. I don't know if I can identify one car here. And the women's clothes are incredible for a start. Everyone's clothing here is just so fancy. Look at these. You know, these hats, did they really walk around wearing these hats all the time? Um, are these the kind of people that would be on the Titanic? I think if it was any time after 1905, we'd have more cars. So for that reason, are they cars? Are they cars there? I, I just can't tell. I cannot tell. That is a car, isn't it? Right, this is changing it for me. Although I did say earlier that there would be more cars in New York in 1905. However, I'm gonna go 1906. And that is my answer. Oh, 1911, it is later, it is Titanic. Still a lot of horse and carts around and I'm in a position now where I need maximum points on this last one. Oh, oh, okay. Now this is significant. Mission accomplished with George W. Bush. So, this will be a significant speech. Are they leaving Iraq? Have they done what they need to do in Iraq? Or Iraq, the end of the Iraq war, which was when? When was that? 
2006? No. Started in 2001. When was Iraq over? I'm not going to get this bang on. I'm going to go 2006. 2003. And we've been left hanging on 3834. Okay, what I'm going to do to speed things up and ensure the 4,000 in this video so that in future videos we can do one Google per round or something like that, I'm going to move quickly. I'm going to go with my gut. I'm just going to go for it. What do we got here? CNA. Yeah, this is modern. This is modern. 2019. 2022 okay oh that is that's a bit ago that is a bit ago I don't know what it is the haircuts the t-shirts uh, 2004 sprung to mind so that's what I'm gonna go with 2003 come on I love that I love that bloody love that right this is that is a a Renault 5, isn't it? A Renault Campus, as it was called in Britain. That's 80s. I mean, that's early 80s. No, can't be any earlier than 1980, that car. This is 80s, definitely. I look at that shirt as well. So I think we've got to, we've looked at the car. We've got to look at the people now. I'm going to go 85. I feel pretty good about that. 87. Fair enough. Where is that? Spain? France? I would say Spain. Uh, we're doing all right. Oh, God. This is... Uh... Oh, it's so hard because they're all old. So their fashion will be all off. That's really hard. Uh, 60, 66. Oh, 52. Oh my God. Blown it. Judging by the cars and the 92, judging by the people as well. 95, not bad. That phone is pretty old, but the quality of the photo isn't too bad. 2006. Nice. 2008. This is all right. It's an interesting photo. Wow. Is that a Russian prisoner of war or something? It's got to be World War Two. I'm going to go in the thick of World War Two, 1943. 1942, good. Come on, keep it up. Oh my God. Is this the Wright Brothers? If so, 1905. Obviously, in World War One, you've got planes, you know, that functioned for combat. 1908. Oh, it's 1914. Shit, I need a, I need a corker here. Oh, now this is, this is it. Ah, oh, it's not the game I was thinking of. What was that game that was like a predecessor to Paint? And you could drag like butterflies and shit all over the place. That looks a bit more modern. HP. 2001, 2002 for me. Maybe 2003. 2002. 2006, what? We're so close, guys. We're so close. Mars. 
Some of this stuff looks pretty damn old. Look at that. 2005. Come on. Great start. This looks very 60s. It's very Scooby Doo. It's very. Yeah, Albina. 67, 68. I'm going to 67. 72, what? Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Facebook. Dance thing won't be before like two thousand and ten. Twenty fourteen. Twenty ten. Putin. Looks fairly old. Twenty eighteen. Not far off, we got one more go. This is to clinch it. That is an old pub. With a big tall ceiling. Oh, this is in America, isn't it? It's an old saloon bar. Jesus, man. My gut said 1911. So that's what I'm going. Come on! <laughs> Get in! Get the hell in, man. One year out on that last one. 1911, it was 1910. Boom! I've got to see the results there because, you know, I had a few goes there, but that, that was a great guess. Couldn't have done it without that one. That wasn't so good. I don't know if they're a bit behind the times. I think it's she's the main culprit. But yeah, looking at some of them, it is a bit more 70s now that you know, now that you have hindsight. Um, that one wasn't a good guess. I was four years out. Facebook, become a fan on Facebook. Should have known that was early Facebook, but I thought it you know, they might be a bit behind if it's India. Two years out on that one, didn't just guessing on Putin's age. And that one took the biscuit. I have kept you long enough with this video, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Let me know if you have any ideas for this. I was thinking one Google per round. I was thinking unlimited Googling, but you have to get everyone bang on. I think that would be still very, very hard. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments and I'll see you for episode 6 of How Not to Travel America. It's gonna thump. Until then, take care. Oh, and drop me a like, please.